The inspiration for Holmes, a refugee story is completely from Abubakar Al Rabia. He was actually my student in his grade nine year. And one day I pulled a conversation card that asked, what is the secret wish you have? And he thought, I want to share my story. Holmes is an exploration of how a new Canadian, despite their past, shares a lot in common with all other Canadians. The inspiration behind this stage adaptation of Holmes' Refugee Story actually came from Dennis. Dennis had read the book in a cabin in the mountains somewhere and he told me that as soon as he finished reading it, he knew that it belonged on the stage at the Grand Theatre. The audience will be surprised how the terror and the laughter in the Iraq and Syria scenes it's just as likely to happen here in Canada. We hope that this play can encourage people to take a courageous and compassionate view when faced with people whose ideas or actions are difficult or unfamiliar to us. My co-writer, Haysom, and I really clicked from the very beginning because he understood what was the most important part of Abu Bakr's story. And the most important part of Bakar's story is the fact that this family, they're not victims of circumstance, they're not victims of war. They want it to be defined by their love and by their laughter and their resilience, and we wanted to continually shine the light on that. What was really important to the storytelling process from Bakar to Haysom and myself was the fact that we felt that this art form could shed light on the humanity behind the horror and to bring the people in these different um, crises into focus. This is Holmes, A Refugee Story, live and in person at the Grand Theatre.